Hey guys, how's it going? So today I have a video showing you the rare non-member items. Now in my Animal Jam vs Club Penguin video, I talked a little bit about non-member, I guess, availability of items on both games. And I read through the comments and saw that Animal Jam apparently gives more items to its non-members than Club Penguin. So what I decided to do was sort of raise awareness of the items in the past that were given out to non-members to hopefully see if you guys possibly recognize any items you may have seen as a non-member rare item. Now I might make a video again about Animal Jam and Club Penguin, although I think my first video covered the topic, but it did start a lot of conversation on comparing both games as they do draw similar audiences, and so I wanted to make this video to sort of touch upon the most common topic in the comments. So the page starts off by saying, I made this page so you can tell which penguin is older than the other. I will update this page soon. It says this page does not have the items in order of which they came out. They are ordered by which items are oldest, older, newer, from top to bottom. So I'm going to go down and read the first three, and then I'm just going to list the rest of them. So the list is somewhat long, and there are it's interesting because there are some items that repeat in different colors. For example, the blue and red sunglasses, there's another green pair that's considered a rare non-member item. So there is a little bit of repetition between the items and it's interesting to note that to see what items are considered rare and the time span from which they differ. So let's go ahead and read off the first one. It says, okay, so of course the rarest item in Club Penguin is the beta hat. Then we have the second item is the black hook, which the picture for some reason didn't load. Then we go down, it says, the pink toque, which I believe is what Antarctic wears, and I think I'm pronouncing that right. Now we go down the list a little bit more. The red lay, the black bow tie, the red and blue sunglasses, the non-member pizza apron, the bunny ears, and they said they'll get a bigger picture soon. The orange water wings, the ice skates, the lighthouse shirt, red beanie, one year anniversary hat, the Santa beard, <clears throat> the pirate belt, which was the author's first item. The snowflake t-shirt and the ice crown, which I believe were recently available in the past year, year and a half. The pirate boots, the novelty glasses, blue propeller cap, the blue bunny ears, the blue, the puffle bandana, the green inflatable duck, the blue lay, the flower headdress, and the green sunglasses. The bandana, which I believe it's called the red bandana, it might just be called the bandana. Uh, the umbrella hat, the blue water wings, the fishing rod, the marshmallow on a stick, cotton candy, paddle ball toy, lollipop candy, candy necklace, feather tiara, the second year party hat, the Halloween basket, the Halloween scarf, the winged helmet, the bell, the Santa hat, reindeer antlers, Christmas scarf, the festive maracas, the life vest, the seaweed belt, the yellow snorkel, the uh, gigantic St. Patrick's hat, the green bunny ears, which this is sort of the repetition where you have the blue, red, and pink bunny ears. The swirly glasses, the red propeller hat, the sailor shirt, not sure what it's called, and then they have the sailor hat listed as the last one with no picture. Now, it does say that he updated it, I believe, back in 2008, but the reason why I still figured I'd make a video on this is because these are some of the most well-known rare items. Now, Club Penguin Wiki does have a list on all rare items that exist so far or are considered rare, ones that possibly haven't been featured in recent catalogs and are still somewhat known, but they don't go into specifics about if it's a non-member or a member list, and it doesn't provide somewhat of a an organized list like this one does, so I really appreciated the time and the effort that this author put into this video, or this web page rather, and I'm gonna leave a link in the description to this page. Now what I wanna know from you guys is, how many of these items do you actually have? Although they might have been featured again in more recent catalogs, so it might take away some of the rare aspect to it, but I wanna know how many on this list do you guys have and what items do you guys not consider rare anymore? So I think, let me see here, I remember going back on the list, yeah, they did feature the blue snowflake and the ice crown. Uh, um, <clears throat> I think there were codes that you could type in. So those are, and this, it's an example of an item that was featured again that might not be rare anymore. But when you guys think of rare items and you guys look up videos and different posts about rare items, these are most likely the most common items that will pop up. 
and I think they're the most popular among a lot of users. So that's why I wanted to make this video is because these are sort of the most popular items out there that are considered rare, but they're also non-member items. Which would surprise a lot of people because these items, although maybe featured now in some catalogs, would be member items. So it's interesting to see the sort of progression that Club Penguin went from listing these as non-member going to more rare items that are also can, that are now considered members and how you need a membership to purchase these items. So like I said, I'm going to leave the link in the description to this page here so you guys can go through it and kind of take a list of how many you have. Once again, let me know what items on this list that you have. When did you get them? Were they featured in a more recent catalog or not? Or were they a code? I believe a few of these were codes that you could get. And also let me know what you guys think about the whole non-member inclusion for Club Penguin. I know that was a big issue or a big topic in the last uh, few videos. So let me know guys and with that said I will see you all tomorrow. Have an awesome day. Take care.